Hello guys, me Car Santa say Cap Car 95. I have some breaking news from Pocono Raceway. So I was on YouTube looking for the videos and I saw Brock Beard having this gasping and confusing expression saying, Oh wait a minute, wait a minute. Do I hear Danny Hamlin Kyle Bush fail inspection? And I thought, oh, this has too good to be true, so I guess the official winner of today's race will go to Chase Elliott, so anyways, it is his fourth victory this season, and it came to a shock to me that <laughs> you have two Joe Gibbs racing cars fail <laughs> inspection, so hmm. I wonder if they'll get an L1 penalty despite saying, oh, you passed pre-race inspection, but post-race inspection. I don't know what the pit crew changed in their race cars to make be, to be faster and gain a competitive advantage, but mm, we'll just wait and see what NASCAR has to say. So, yeah. So... If you're a Chase Elliott fan or a motorsports fan in general, you'll be, I mean, giving that fist pump to your friend and saying, hey, we, we've all, as a NASCAR community, won. I'm telling you. <laughs> but just kidding. But, mm. yep, that's a NASCAR golden boy. <laughs> really doing it this season and... <sighs> There's not, not much to say. Like, I didn't watch most of the race since I was playing Forza Horizon 5 and so forth. But I just want to congratulate Trey Selling for winning the M&M's 400. And I guess that's basically it. <laughs> I want to keep it short and sweet so I don't go off tangents and saying, oh, Hmm. Yeah, Chase Ellie, Chase Ellie, man. He's like Kyle, the Kyle Larson of last year, man. I mean, he's racking up wins left and right, I'm telling you. So, I'm at Capricorn Hope y'all race fans have a good evening and peace out.